Are you looking to self-publish a book about the new Tesla truck? Have you been wondering how to use a brand name in your book? Well, you're in luck because today I'm going to talk about using a brand name in your book. So stick around. Hey, right, writers, Keith Wheeler here. And if you want to continue to get all the hints, tips, and tricks on how to make self-publishing easier, then be sure to subscribe to the channel, smash that little bell icon so you get alerted each and every time I put out a new video. Okay, so you want to self-publish a book for the new Tesla truck, or perhaps you want to include the brand like Coca-Cola into your next story. So the question is, can I put a brand name in my book? Disclaimer, I am not a lawyer, I don't even play one on TV, but based on the research I've done, here's what I found when it comes to using a brand name in your book. There are four areas of law to consider in connection with brand names. And those are trademark infringement, trademark dilution, trademark tarnishment, and defamation. First, we'll cover trademark infringement. This is where you make it look like the owner is the one that wrote the book. For example, the official guide to the Tesla truck, or that your character was the inventor. Next, we'll talk about trademark dilution. This is where you minimize the power of a brand name by generalizing it. Examples like Xeroxing something instead of saying photocopying it, or saying your character is Googling something instead of searching on the web. Now, these usually don't affect writing community too much, but just to be safe, again, use something like searching instead of Googling. Let's talk about trademark tarnishment. This is where you use a brand in a disparaging way like using a specific brand of vehicle to help your character rob a bank. And you may be wondering, well then how do movies get away with this? The simple answer is typically the manufacturer will pay for product placement in the movie. And last but certainly not least is trademark defamation. This is probably the most serious and this is when you falsely depict a brand or product as being dangerous or defective. For example, having a malfunction in a car and have it blow up the character in your book or having an entire case of Coca-Cola poison the hometown of your main character. So, can you use brand names like the new Tesla truck in your story or novel? The short answer is yes. You just need to use sensible precaution. If you just want to use it as like a product placement, some nonchalant use, then you should be absolutely fine and there should be no issues. However, if you plan on using a product in a negative way or even a questionable light, or if you're gonna have your character invent something, then your best bet would be to create a fictitious name for that product. Now, when you're done writing your book, you probably need to format it to upload it to KDP. Well, check out this video right here, and I'll show you step-by-step -step how to format your paperback book. Or you can check out this video that YouTube says you'll absolutely love. I'll see you in the next video, and remember to write right.